full throttle drag racing on ESPN2, the farmland of Kansas, the bread basket to the nation. Beautiful, beautiful stretch of lands. Well, when funny car driver Matt Hagen isn't driving his funny cars in Virginia, he runs a 500-acre cattle farm. We sent a camera crew to Matt's farm to see how hard this young driver really works when he's not at the track. Yeah, I've been running the farm here for, I guess, uh, two years now on my own. My family bought this land. We were planning on building some homes out here, and obviously the, the housing market's not been ideal. So, uh, you know, uh, it came about that I had the opportunity to just really farm it aggressively, and, uh, you know, and I jumped all over. I tell you, if those guys see me doing this at the race team, they'll have me put me to work, won't they? probably good. I don't know, I'm kind of rough on stuff, so they, they take pretty good care of their stuff. <laughs> I always bring it, bring it back beat up, you know, you might, so. You might order to stick to uh, putting your putting your gate up, right? Yeah, they, uh, they're they always upset with me because it was a perfectly good race car when they gave it to me and I brought it back all trashed. Farming is very hands-on. Um, it's, it's a lot of hard work, you know, it's, it's one of those things where you, if you're scared of getting out here and getting dirty and breaking a sweat, then you, you know, it's not something for you. But if you like to be outdoors and, and you just like to be a, a hands-on kind of person, I mean, that, it's what it's all about. All right, that all done. It's a lot of hard work, but in turn, you, you know, it's, it's a good, honest living and that's the, the type, of, type of living I want to make, you know. Catch catfish. Sorry. <laughs> oh man, I forgot she was on the mic here. I was on the mic. The most challenging thing is definitely these cattle. I would love to say that all my cattle are tame and you know you can go up there and pet them, but it's just not the case. I guess she's gonna be a fence jumper, you know what I mean? Did you get that on camera? Yeah. <laughs> That's exactly what I mean. There's a bunch of wild cows on camera. I've been knocked down and kicked and butted and thrown up against gates and everything else, and just been lucky enough I ain't got hurt bad enough so I can still go drive a race car. I think Matt will always be here on the farm. Uh, you know, this is, uh, of course, racing is, you know, it's his passion, but, you know, he needs a place and a time to relax and take away from the racing. Hopefully I can raise my children here, and if they want to raise theirs here too, you know, that's great too. You know, it's, it's one of those things where this is where I call home, and I plan on being here for a long time.